Now, I understand aside from actually doing relationship management and also uh, poker managing in the past, he also teach as well. So one of the questions I, I'm really interested to know is, what is your perspective on integration of AI in the education institutions? I mean, there has been a very heated debate over the pros and cons of integrating AI, right? Um, I will say that for the most part, I do believe there are more benefits than always the cons. It's just a matter of really kind of regulate what AI can potentially do, right? Uh, while it's unfortunate that we have not fully kind of developed or integrated AI into our education system, there are a lot of benefits that you could provide us, right? Um, in my position in particular, uh, you will be able to help me um, develop a more personalized programming for our clients, first of all. Um, second of all, I would say from a student's perspective, AI is able to, you know, um, provide a lot more targeted resources um, instead of, you know, right now what we have is just, hey, here's a library, hey, full of books and just figure out what you need and grab from there, right? So it definitely is um, going to provide a lot of uh, benefits to the students as well. And finally, you know, when it comes to things like administrative tasks, it's definitely, you know, AI is going to be able to do a lot of that in the future and free us up to kind of focus on more important things, right? Since such as, you know, customization and, you know, like I mentioned before, client satisfaction, right? So the building that relationship and bring it to the next level, right? But, you know, on the other hand, um, it is important to, kind of realize that, you know, the system can be abused, right? Um, where we see the lane to the pandemic where a lot of students are kind of using AI to kind of uh, write their papers for them, et cetera, et cetera. So I think we're definitely kind of getting over that hump where the uh, technology and the schools and the institution uh, are able to kind of catch a lot of those things to make sure that our students are still, uh, you know, receiving quality education, right? That they are actually learning from us. But it's just something that, you know, we need to keep on working on and improve going forward. Now, at this rate, would you see AI would replace education institution or courses or even like professional development programs in the future? I mean... Who can say like 20, 30, 50 years down the road, right? Um, I, I for one, cannot see that far into the future. But I would say, you know, as much as AI can provide for us, right, there's that human touch that a lot of people are creating, right? Um, one example of this is that, you know, uh, post-pandemic, there's a lot of people, there's surgery in in-person training. Right. A lot of people are choosing to come in person to take our programs rather than, you know, taking them online or in a hybrid environment, for example. Right. It's just because you cannot really replace the that interaction component. Right. Uh, having AI teach you to how to do something isn't the same as having another person and having that discussion. Right. So I don't think AI will fully replace uh, how we learn uh, and the human component of the education, but I do think that it could be a strong supplement to it.